Welcome to One or More Jokes a Day with Ryan Guerra, where I try to tell as many jokes as I can about today's news. So let's get started. Joe Biden and Kamala Harris were chosen as Time Magazine's Person of the Year. And upon hearing the news, Trump claimed fraud and said, there's no way two people can be one person. <laughs> Trump thought he should have won and claimed Time Magazine's Person of the Year selection process was unfair since he was competing against two people. The White House Chief of Staff Mark Meadows told the head of the FDA to approve the Pfizer vaccine or else resign. You know, with all the resignations, it got me thinking the Trump administration must be celebrating the 12 resignations of Christmas. A recent op-ed by the Wall Street Journal suggested Jill Biden should drop the title doctor because she isn't a real medical doctor. But speaking of inappropriate titles, we've been calling Melania Trump first lady for the past four years. So instead of calling her the first lady, we should have been calling her by her real name. Candy to the main stage, candy to the main stage. <laughs> Yesterday, the nation celebrated as the first vaccine shots were being administered around the country. White House staffers were supposed to be one of the earliest ones to receive the vaccine shots. That was until Trump informed his staff that nobody's receiving the vaccine shot if they're on Trump's naughty list. <laughs> Bill Barr, you think I won the election? Naughty. <laughs> Speaking of Trump's denial to let White House staffers be the first to get the vaccine shot, Trump said, my staff doesn't need the vaccine shot. Everyone's pretty much already recovered from COVID. <laughs> and finally, people across the country are lining up to receive their free shots. Even Don Jr. got in line. Well, that wasn't until he found out it was for the vaccine and not free tequila shots. <laughs> and that's the news for December 15th. I hope you like this video and subscribe to my channel. Otherwise, I'll see you tomorrow.